The MGH Francis H. Burr Proton Therapy Center is the product of a long tradition of research, visionary thinking, and collaboration between MGH and Harvard University. This tradition begins in the 1940s when Robert R. Wilson, a physicist who worked on the atomic bomb, joins Harvard University, determined to find a peaceful use for atomic energy. He proposes a radical idea. Wilson believes that protons accelerated to high speeds by a new generation of machines intended for atomic research can also be used for medical treatment. Protons, energized by particle accelerators such as the cyclotron at Harvard, could eradicate unhealthy tissue. In 1960, Dr. Raymond Chelberg, a neurosurgeon at MGH, approaches Harvard to see if he can use its cyclotron to realize Wilson's vision. Andy Kohler at the Harvard Cyclotron Laboratory agrees to collaborate. Chelberg, working with Andy Kohler and his team, discover how to harness an extraordinary behavior of high-energy protons. It is the Bragg peak, a localized burst of exceptionally high energy released by a proton just before it stops. Their innovation enhances the destruction of diseased tissue without harming nearby healthy tissue. This breakthrough allows Dr. Chelberg to pioneer the application of the Bragg peak in proton therapy to treat neurological lesions. Then, in 1973, MGH radiation oncologist Dr. Herman Sood begins treating patients with other forms of cancer with protons at the Harvard Cyclotron Laboratory. Motivated by their success, MGH decides to transition from the experimental setting at Harvard to a full clinical program. In 2001, a new chapter begins when a new proton treatment facility is built at Massachusetts General Hospital and the Harvard lab closes. This new center is designed to expand the ability to treat different types and locations of tumors. Bringing proton therapy to the MGH was clearly a milestone in cancer therapy. We continue to look at ways to make proton therapy even more focused in its nature. The pencil scanning beam is a new advance within the field of proton therapy and allows the radiation to conform almost perfectly to the volume of the tumor that we're treating. MGH continues to develop new technologies, such as improving computer modeling of the human body and proton beam to achieve even greater precision in the treatment plan. With the new proton therapy system designed for the adjacent Blunder building, MGH will continue to lead the way in implementing treatment expertise and capabilities that meet the needs of its patients.